Hello. Manish, Anandita, can you hear me? Supajit. Good afternoon, Jay, sir. Hello. Yeah, hi, Anandita. Manita here. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Garu. Yeah, yeah. Happy Independence Day, sir. Greetings to you, too. Yeah. I think Minister, sir, is stuck uh, with the collector. Hi, hi, ma'am. Am I audible? Yeah, yeah you are audible. Good afternoon, Jay, sir. Good afternoon, Jay, sir. Yeah, hi. Good afternoon to you, Anandita. Oh. Yes, yes. So, we, we, uh, ma'am, we will start off. Yeah, yeah, we can start off. We are uh, almost 10 minutes past. Good evening, everyone. Welcome you to India's 74th Independence Day and CII Telangana's virtual music concert. A very happy Independence Day to you. I am Anindita, CII Telangana's Tourism and Cultural Committee's chairperson, welcoming you all. Before we start, request everyone to rise up for the national anthem, please. Jai Hind. Now we start our program. The entire CIA family is here. Eminent guests, 
are here with us today. We also have Sri Jai Shranjanji, Principal Secretary, Industry and Commerce and IT and C Department, Government of Telangana. We welcome you, sir. But before you start the program, I request Ms. Vanita Datla, Vice Chairperson and Managing Director, Elico Limited, past chairperson, CII Telangana State Council, and of course, our mentor for our Tourism and Cultural Committee for her welcome address to the guests. Over to you, ma'am. very much visible. CII also has been, has been celebrating 125 years of existence this year. And in line with our vision, not only to look after industry and industrial ecosystem, but also to bring about a very, very holistic development of humans. That means, that means both the work-life balance, as well as the softer side of art, culture, tourism, sport, elements also to be considered as our nation grows forward. As a result of this, CII Telangana did constitute a tourism and culture committee or a sub, a sub task force almost three to four years back with an envisioned focus on this domain, especially to enhance Telangana as well as Hyderabad as a destination that should be on every traveler's list that should be a growing, a fast growing, vibrant state, and also to offer a lot of options for people living here, for families residing here, for, for people working here to enjoy the art, the culture, the tradition, the cuisine, the handlooms, and the architectural sites all around us. So on that so note, I'd like to welcome all of you today to this first of its kind virtual concert that does bring about a fusion of the North Indian Hindustani styles, as well as the South Indian Carnatic styles, both in the fields of dance and in the fields of instrumental music. We have with us today extremely good artists on uh, very, very, very uh, famous artists that will actually enthrall us with their offerings. And I will wish all of you to please stay throughout the event, enjoy and uh, let us support all these artisans today because in this COVID times, when livelihoods have been affected, when people going to visit concerts or to visit tourism sites or to at least uh, help out that particular industry and domain is at stake. And a lot of people are suffering because of you know, the lockdown issues and uh, the distancing issues. Let us now uh, take a pledge to help out in the coming days, these sectors that have been so ravished by this ongoing pandemic. On that note, I'd like to welcome you all to this virtual music contest, uh, concert. And uh, of course, we are very happy that Jay Sir has agreed to come and agree, uh, uh, come and uh, address us. We were actually hoping for the Honorable Minister also to come and address us, but unfortunately, he got stuck on his uh, visit, I think, to the districts uh, because uh, of the Independence Day events. So on that note, I'll hand it over to Anandita. Uh, she, of course, as she has mentioned, is taken over this year as the convener of this task force. And with her expertise and with Mr. Manish, who is the co-convener, I think they will take it to greater heights. Thank you all for joining us today. And I'll hand it over to Anandita. Thank you so much, ma'am. Without you, we really cannot go a step ahead. We need always your mentoring with us. Thank you so much. Uh, with this, we now welcome Sri Jay Shranjanji, Principal Secretary, Industries and Commerce, IT, ENC Department, Government of Telangana State. Uh, we all know Jay Shri, very, very close and interested and enthusiastic about cultural programs. I think any uh, cultural evening where any concert where I have gone and I did not see Jay Shri, hardly it happens. Thank you so much for all that encouragement, sir. I request you now for your kind address. Thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Anandita. Good afternoon, uh, Vanita Garu, all the other uh, representatives from CIA, CII, and most importantly, 
all the patrons of uh, arts, culture, music, and all the fine things which are there to enjoy in life. Let me first of all convey my Independence Day greetings to all of you and also congratulate uh, CII, the subgroup for the Committee for uh, Tourism, Arts, Culture, Hospitality for thinking of this event, for conceptualizing this event. I mean, there can be no better day than to appreciate uh, the rich talent which is there in our country than the Independence Day. So I'm very glad that you are organizing this event. In the current scenario where there is so much of uh, despondency, so much of gloom, we always look up to things which will bring uh, optimism in our lives, cheer in our lives. And when we appreciate uh, such kind of refined and finer things of life, we do get a sense that uh, things will one day become uh, good and back to normal in this world. We also must uh, realize that amongst uh, all sections of the society which have got impacted due to this pandemic, the society or the community of uh, artists, cultural performers is also one of them. They also have not been able to perform before a live audience. And uh, as we know, while the most eminent artists can somehow manage uh, through their own uh, wherewithal, but the smaller uh, uh, part of the player, the players in the in the ecosystem, people who arrange for the events, who provide for all the tech tech support, who are accompanists to the artists, they are uh, definitely getting affected by not having regular work for months now. And uh, we should also think about their welfare, their well-being. When uh, live events happen, we of course uh, enjoy everything and we do appreciate the fact that a background team does all this work but when nothing is happening let us also look at ways in which we can help and support them but nevertheless i'm very happy that this concert is happening here and uh, some of the best uh, known artists are participating many from hyderabad i look forward to the performances by uh, <clears throat> yamini reddy by mangla bhat and everyone else this is a very impressive lineup and uh, again, uh, much more than uh, speaking and uh, lecturing, I look forward to really having a wonderful time over the next uh, couple of hours. So once again, congratulations, Independence Day greetings and uh, all the best for this concert. Thank you so, Thank much, you so sir. much, sir. I'm sure you would enjoy the evening. In fact, uh, to tell all our viewers, uh, Honorable Minister for Tourism and Secretary of Tourism both were uh, supposed to be uh, attending, but uh, suddenly they got stuck with some council meetings and uh, they have regretted not being part of this evening today and congratulated CII, uh, it's 25 years of service and especially this evening uh, of uh, the virtual musical concert. Uh, with this, uh, a little about CII and the uh, count committee which is organizing this uh, beautiful event uh, of uh, we i mean i am expressing uh, my heartfelt thanks to all of you uh, who are present today and uh, uh, on behalf of uh, my tourism panel and especially uh, co-chair mr manish daya who is the uh, general manager of novotel hyderabad international convention center so a little about cii now uh, today, to celebrate 125 years of service to the nation and also to celebrate the 74th Independence Day, we at CII have organized this meeting for you. Uh, we are really going through a tough time. And of course, uh, the morale is quite down for every one of us. So this is just a small endeavor to lift up the mood for two hours of all our viewers. I hope we be successful in this. Uh, as you are aware, uh, CII plays a very proactive role in India's development process. Founded over 125 years ago, it is India's premier business association with a direct membership of over 9,000 organizations commendable from, a, from private as well as public sectors and indirect membership of over two lakh companies. At CII Telangana, among the other verticals which uh, the state council has, we also have this culture and tourism panel to address the challenges and the upcoming opportunities in the sector. And I'm happy to share with you 
that we work very closely with government of Telangana state on these lines. We keep on meeting Minister Garu and also uh, Tourism Secretary. Uh, we have just met uh, some few days ago to discuss how we can go ahead. So all stakeholders are benefited from these activities is only our motto. In this context, we recently had a meeting also with Honorable uh, Minister Sir on the occasion of World Yoga Day, where we uh, performed uh, yoga and promoted fitness from his official residence and it was, it was also telecast all over uh, live on YouTube and our WebEx channels. And we discussed the panel activities also along with today's musical concert, which we had planned uh, long ahead. The upcoming tourism summit, uh, last year in February, we had the summit. This time it is not physically possible. So we are working towards how we can virtually organize this summit, uh, tourism summit to bring all stakeholders, all members of the tourism and culture fraternity together to see how uh, well we can benefit. It can be a win-win situation for everyone. We are also very keen on working with government of Telangana to help them draft the much needed tourism policy. In fact, this also we uh, have been uh, in touch with them. Uh, Mrs. Datla also when she was chairing the committee uh, we went and we spoke about it and of course unfortunately this pandemic happened so we could not continue but we have again started the discussion and i'm sure this tourism policy which will be helpful in attracting stakeholders uh, and i mean investments uh, in the newest state of uh, telangana in this regard towards working on this initiative and celebrating 125 years of cii journey we have organized this musical evening today I am delighted to share with you that we have eminent personalities from the music and dance fraternity. We have uh, Srimati Mangala Bhatt, who would be performing Kathak today, uh, Kuchipuri by Mrs. Yamini Reddy. All are extremely very, very famous, uh, you know, dance uh, dancers. Uh, Dr. DVK Vasudevan, uh, fondly known as uh, Violin Vasuji. Uh, Sri uh, Ram, Ram Prapanna, Bhattacharya, who will be performing a sitar today. And of course, we will start the program with Dr. Satarupa Roy Kaur, vocalist. So I leave the, uh, the stage to them. Uh, they themselves will introduce and explain what they are going to perform. I really, from the bottom of my heart, thank all the artists for spending their valuable time and coming forward to uh, support CII, uh, CII Telangana for this uh, uh, occasion. Uh, and I'm sure all of you will be enjoying. So now I uh, request Dr. Satarupa Kaur to please come. Before that, uh, we would end this uh, inaugural session by extending vote of thanks to everyone who's been watching uh, this uh, program. So with this, I request uh, our committees Co-Chair Manish Daya, General Manager Novotel uh, Hyderabad International Convention Center to kindly come forward and extend the vote of thanks, please. And of course, uh, Mr. Manish, thank you. Uh, I mean, for you, it will be difficult to thank yourself, but we definitely, from the heart of, uh, from CII, on behalf of CII, I thank you uh, to arrange all this and Novotel for you know, uh, giving us this venue to hold this program. It wouldn't have been possible otherwise. Manish, please, thanks. Namaste. Friends, first of all, I would like to thank each and every one of you for joining us this evening, wishing everyone a very happy Independence Day. Thank you very much for joining in through this virtual uh, option uh, and gracing this occasion. This decade has started on a turbulent note with the pandemic COVID-19 and the world is pushed into an unprecedented situation.
culture of fraternity, and of course, the music lovers. It's a real pleasure virtually being with all of you today uh, to attend this wonderful musical evening uh, put together and hope you enjoy it. Well, finally, I would also like to take this opportunity and thank all our sponsors who have actually made this evening possible and made it possible for us to reach out to each and every one of you. I thank our associate sponsors, Netco Pharma, Shanta Vasan Trust, and also thank our co-associate sponsors, Bharat Biotech International Limited, and of course, the hospitality partner, which is Novotel Hyderabad Convention Center. I would also like to put on record and thank our members, uh, Subhajit and Anurag, for putting this entire evening together and making it possible at this moment. I now request uh, Anindita ji, uh, who is, of course, the head corporate communication for LNT Metro Rail Hyderabad, and of course, our convener for CI Telangana Culture and Tourism, to now take over for the musical performances. Over to you, Anindita ji. Uh, dhanyawad and Jai Hind, and most importantly, stay safe. Thank you very much. Thank you, and enjoy the evening. Before we start, we uh, would like you to enjoy a short film made for CIA Telangana's 125-year celebration.
We start this musical evening with Dr. Satrupa Kaur Rai. She's a versatile singer from Hyderabad. Though she did her PhD in biotechnology, she always tried to continue her musical career as well. She learned Hindustani classical from Sri Upendranath Ghosh and Srimati Prema De. She also learned Nojrul Giti and Bangla Adhunik from Srimati Khaya Chattopadhyay. Currently, she is learning semi classical music under the tutelage of Guru. Shri Anjan Majumdar. Over to you, over to you Dr. Shatru Kapoor.
जगद My next presentation is Vande Matara, based on Rama Desh. Vande My last performance will be a fusion on Raghavai Ravi. Actually, this project was supposed to be released today only, but we could not finish the whole project due to this lockdown situation. Today, 
I get, I got this opportunity. I feel privileged to showcase this song on this prestigious platform. And also, I would like to mention my co-artist's name here. Uh, the whole music arrangement, music composition was done by Shobhik Devdorian. My co-singers were Shahana Bhattacharya, Srijit Chakraborty, and Shobhik Devdorian. I also would like to pay my gratitude to all the musicians who wonderfully played music over this track. Today, I am using the original track that we had prepared. Let's hope you will enjoy it. I'm taking a few seconds to prepare the track. Okay, I got it. Sarini sa, sarini sa, sa gama pa gama ni pa gare. Sarini sa, sarini sa, sa gama pa gama tha pa gare. Re gama pa gani 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 pa tha pa, pa gani sa ga sa da, ga sa. Mare ga sa ni re sa ni tha pa ma ga. Baat chalat nahi, chunari rang dari. Baat chalat nahi, chunari rang dari. Hey, I saw we dar dar wari. Baat chalat nahi, chunari rang dari. Baat chalat nahi, chunari rang dari. Hey, I saw we dar dar wari. I saw ni pate ni dar, maane nahi langar. Apne dhinga dhari karat barajore. He more ram, he more ram, he more ram. Baat chalat nahi, chunari rang dari. Baat chalat. Dundanani kasi nandalal ko Dundanani kasi nandalal ko Chaho tisha chitavat Dekha na pavat Garash deho mohe kaanha Garash deho mohe kaanha Radha Vrij ko chali Aaj Radha Vrij ko chali Aaj Radha बाट चलत नहीं चुनरी रंग डारी बाट चलत नहीं चुनरी रंग डारी के ऐसो बेदर दवन वारी ऐसो निपट निडार माने नहीं लंगर अपने धिंगा धारी करट वारा जोरे हिमोरे राम हिमोरे राम हिमोरे राम बाट चलत नहीं चुनरी रंग डारी बाट 
बहुत चलत सुर के नदिया हर दिशा से बह के सागर मिले बादलों का रूप लेकर भर से हल्के हल्के मिले सुर मेरा तुम्हारा मिले सुर मेरा तुम्हारा तो सुर बने हमारा मिले सुर मेरा तुम्हारा मिले सुर मेरा तुम्हारा तो सुर बने हमारा तो सुर बने हमारा ओ सुर बने हमारा जय हिंद आई होप यू एंजॉयड डॉक्टर सर्ज परफॉर्मेंस वी ऑफकोर्स डेड here uh, an artist recognition can never be enough what we only can do here this evening on behalf of cii family uh, a small token of appreciation for uh, dr satarupa and for this i request mr manish to please do the honors thank you manish ji thank you dr satarpo thank you so much what a performance after music now it's time for some dance performance a kathak exponent is mangala bhat other than she being a very dear friend to me the name mangala personifies auspiciousness grace and elegance as an artist every movement every performance is a prayer offered at the feet of goddess saraswati goddess of learning and she believes to her to her guru pandit durga lal ji the core of her artistic being as a performer the finesse the restraint the energy of her kathak have illuminated the stage at every festival of india and abroad she is an ambassador of a kathak exponent of the earth her work spans continents and art forms with collaboration ranging from western classical percussion instruments to contemporary poetry as a teacher she has ignited the spark of love of classical dance in every young children and has nurtured talent through her dance academy akruti kathak kendra a premier kathak institute of india entering the artistic presence of the prestigious kathak kendra in new delhi mangla initially trained was trained under late shri kundalal gangani ji and later took forward training under the kathak maestro late pandit durga lal ji from whom she absorbed his brilliant technique and mastered the dazzling cadence and subtle nuances of kathak her her hard work and sincere efforts took her to major productions choreographed by guru pandit durga lal ji and pandit biju maharaj ji today this this evening she is going to start with guru stotram salutations are to that guru who showed 
me the award, the one who is to be known, whose form is the entire universe, and by whom all the movable and immovable are pervaded. Salutations are to the Guru who opened the eye of one blind due to the darkness cover of ignorance with a needle coated with the ointment of knowledge. Salutations are to that Guru who is the sun to the lotus of Vedanta and whose lotus feet are made radiant by jewel of all Upanitya. The second performance, I'm continuing this so that uh, she can perform at a I, uh, continuously and I don't uh, inter you know, interrupt for a break. The second will be on Tintal. The technique is to build by the use of an intricate system of footwork. Pure dance, Nitra is all important where complex rhythmic patterns are created through the use of the flat feet and the control of sound of the ankle bells borne by the dancer. Kathak builds its pure dance sequences by combining units of movements with lots of lyrical movements, agile footwork, and sweet and swift work. You have to witness Mangala to understand what I have just mentioned. Over to you, Mangala. Welcome.
What do I say? Mesmerizing Mangla, as always, brilliant you were. Uh, with this, we would like to just extend a token of appreciation, Mangala, if you can please come over to the stage again. I request Mr. Manish. Manish, can you please come over on the stage to felicitate Mangala, please? Thank you, CII, and congratulations to everyone on 74th Independence of India. Thank you all. Now we come to our next performance of the evening, instrument. We have with us Dr. DVK Vasudevan, fondly known as Violin Vasu, is a rare combination of performer and academician in the field of Indian music. He is a disciple of legendary violinist Nara Sudarnava, Dr. Anna Varapu Ramaswamy. He performed all over the world in prestige, prestigious festivals like Namaste France, World Wood Festival, USA, Sankat Mochan Festival, Varanasi, HTAMF, TCF, to name a few. He holds a PhD in music and an eighth grade in Western music from Trinity College of London. He teaches music at University of Hyderabad and also visiting faculty music at IITH and IITH. He has several international research publications and books to his credit. He's one of the most sought after Karnatak violin gurus with 20,000 followers across the globe. Through Sabarmati Sangeet, a project to teach human values through music, Vasu conducted free workshops to more than one lakh children, including juveniles. He founded Sanskrit Foundation, an NGO to promote Indian culture and heritage. He has received Rashtrapati Award, Dr. Abdul Kalam Award, International Award for Young People in Buckingham Palace, London, Samaika Bharat Gaurav Puraskar, Madras Telugu Academy, Young Achievers Award, Rotary Club, Youth Award, AP, Ogadi Purusar, Silicon Andhra, USA, etc. With him, will be accompanying Krishnavaran Koparapu. He took his initial training under Sri Arangi Srinivas Rao and is currently 
under the tutelage of Mridangam Maestro Dr. Patri Satish Kumar. He is one of the upcoming young Mridanganists of the country who has been accompanying many acclaimed artists across India. He has performed in various prestigious sabhas and festivals. He is a recipient of Kalakar Award from Tayagraja TV, Chennai, and has recently won first prize in the competition conducted Sampada in California, USA. Today, the performance which they are going to present will be, he will open his concert with an invocation on Lord Ganesha. This composition is one of the most popular Ganesh Kritis of Karnataki music in Ragam Hamsadvani, Talamadi, composed by one of the Karnataki music trinity, Sri Muthuswami Dikshithar. Next composition, the second one of the evening, will also be another popular composition on Krishna. There is a Telugu version of it, Alai Pungera. This song is composed in Rag, Karnada and Talam, Adi, by another popular composer from South, Sri Ottukadu Venkata Subaya. The last performance of the evening by Violin Vasuji would be to reiterate the importance of patriotism, equality, and oneness. They are one of the masterpieces from Tagore's Akla Chalore, followed by Sare Jahan Se Acha by Mangbad Iqbal, followed by We Shall Overcome or Honge Kaam Yab by Girija Kumar Mathur, later Gandhiji's favorite and popular bhajans, Raghupati Raghava Raja Ram and Vaishnava Janaku, followed by Jaiti Jaiti Bharat Mata, another popular patriotic song in Sanskrit by uh, Sanskrit with Indian national song Bande Mataram, a fusion of it. Enjoy the performance.
thank you, Dr. Vasudevan, or, or as you prefer to be uh, addressed, Violin Vasuji and Mr. Koparaput. That was wonderful performance, and we thank you so much. Uh, just a moment. That was really, really uh, wonderful. So we are really, I mean, it is actually a musical evening. We started with vocal. Uh, I really apologize for the technical glitch. We just came to know that when Dr. Satarupa was uh, singing, there was some technical glitch. Uh, we assure you that uh, after, uh, she will end the program with her songs once again. And I'm sure you're going to love to hear that again. Uh, with this, we come to our next performance. And before that, we would request, I would request um, Mr. Manish to please come over the stage. And Vasuji and Mr. Kaparapu, can you please come to the dais, please? Come to the stage. We would really extend our token of appreciation. That's the least we can do. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And of course, Indushri, the little darling and wonder. Please come. Please come forward. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so Thank much, you. Vasudhi. Thank you. We, we come to our next performance. Dance once again. And when we are in Telangana, Kuchipuri has to be there on the play. Here we have another exponent in Kuchipuri, Srimati Yamini Reddy, daughter and disciple of legendary Kuchipuri exponent Padma Bhushan's Dr. Raja and Radha Reddy is one of the leading Kuchipuri Indian classical dancers of the generation today. A young star of the Kuchipuri firmament, Yamini is a three-time national awardee who has vowed audiences in India and abroad. Yamini has toured across the globe and in Dublin, the mayor of Dublin presented her with the golden key to the city after watching her captivating Kuchipuri dance performance. Three times national awardee Yamaniji has been awarded the Yuvaratna Award, Youth Vocational Excellence Award by the District Road Track Organization, the Young Achievers Award by FLO Delhi and Hyderabad, the Devdasi National Award, Bismillah Khan Yuva Puraskar by Sangeet Natak Academy, the SBJ Legions of Tomorrow title, Jashne Yangistan by News24, and the Pride of Telangana Award in 2019. Yamini was the first dancer ever to perform at the prestigious Wingmore Hall, London in 2011. She has also participated in national and international festivals. Her performance at the BRIC Summit, Russia was highly appreciated. As a Kuchipuri performer, Yamini has been well received in the art circles. Bharat Ratna Pandit Ravi Shankar, Ustad Amjad Ali Khan, and Sarud Rani Sharan Rani Bakliwal, the stalwarts in the field of music and dance, applauded her for the flawless footwork and rhythmic expressions. Pandit Ravi Shankar even complimented her by saying, the Yamini is just made for dance. She is a complete performer. Currently, Yamini head, heads the Natya Tarangini Raja Radha Reddy Institute of Kuchipuri Dance branch in Hyderabad. Here, she trains students at various age groups in the art of Kuchipuri dance. She has her own repertory with whom she forms regularly. Yamini is also actively involved in organizing of the Parampara Series National and International Festival of Dance in Delhi and Hyderabad. What she is going to perform, she would prefer announcing it herself, explaining it herself. So all the stage is all yours, Yamini ji. Welcome. Good evening, friends. It is indeed such a pleasure to be here today and present before you a Kuchipudi dance recital. I am Yamini Reddy, daughter and disciple of Padma Bhushan's doctors Raja Radha Reddy and Kaushalya Reddy. 
In these tough times, it has been especially very, very tough for us artists who have had to stay home. In fact, a lot of artists have also lost their livelihood and we're all struggling, but as it is an artist calling is always to spread positivity through their art. And we have been doing that for the same from our homes. Today, I'm very happy to be back on stage for CII to present a virtual dance concert along with such wonderful artists of the evening, and especially on the occasion of Independence Day. And this Independence Day is very special because this Independence Day reminds us how important Swaraj is or freedom is and how important it is to have freedom. And in, on that note today, I would like to start my Kuchipudi dance recital with a Saraswati Vandana. Now, India is a spiritual country. The entire world looks towards India for its spirituality. And this spirituality even seeps into our art and culture. Education and culture bring awareness. And this awareness and wisdom among people is necessary for a progressive country. And for in, in order for India to progress, it is very important for its culture to thrive. The item that I'm going to present for you now is Saraswati Vandana, Veena Vadini Varade. This is written by the great poet, Surya Kanti Tripathi Nirala. Here, the poet praised goddess Saraswati to fill the country with love and knowledge and prosperity. Kindly see Saraswati Vandana. Oh, my God. 
Thank you very much. Traditionally, it is expected to perform Kuchipudi to either Telugu or Sanskrit verses. But today I had chosen this music because it's so beautiful and so apt for the occasion of Independence Day, where we all pray to Goddess Saraswati to fill our country with prosperity. In this, as you would have seen, there was also a padant, which was by the famous uh, Pandit Kishan Maharaj, the tabla, maestro, tabla Maestro. And it was so beautiful that immediately my father picked it up and he choreographed it and incorporated it in this item. The next piece that I'm going to present for you is also another Hindustani number by the one and only Bharat Ratna Pandit Ravi Shankar. This item is a tarana in Nata Bhairavi. The musical notes and the rhythmic composition is so apt that when Pandit Ji saw this choreography by my parents, he said, Raja, I feel like I have composed this tarana only for Kuchipuri dance. So you can imagine how in this progressive modern India, now that we are not limited by boundaries, that even our art is crossing over and we are seeing influences from different parts of the country, just like I performed right now, Kuchipudi, to Hindustani music in Hindi language. And the next that I'm going to present to you, Atarana, also in Hindustani music. It is said in the Natya Shastra that you can adopt a language if you feel that it will bring greater conviction in your audiences. And nothing is more apt than that today. I will be beginning the next piece with a small Vande Matram as a special tribute to today's concert. And this will be followed by Tarana, where I shall show you a glimpse of the famous plate dance of Kuchipuri. Now this plate dance is not a gimmick. It is a tradition that has been carried from, on for many centuries. And the significance of this plate dance is that when you climb on the rim of a brass plate, it is believed that all your earthly connections are broken and your prayers reach directly to God. In fact, the Rishi Muni is, has been compared, a Rishi Muni in meditation has been compared with a dancer dancing on the rim of a brass plate, not the other way around. So that is the importance of this plate dance and this tradition of plate dance, which is found in Kuchipuri. Kindly see Vande Mataram followed by Tarana. All the items have been choreographed by my parents, Raja Rathari. Thank you very much.
I don't have words enough which can compliment Yamini ji's performance. Such graceful performance. What I mean, it was mesmerizing actually. Yamini ji, thank you so much. Can I request you once again on the stage to felicitate? This is the least we can do, a token of appreciation from CII. What I'm really missing, and I'm sure everyone, uh, CII and CII uh, will, is missing, is a live audience. We had to do this virtual concert, keeping the safety in mind and the, uh, uh, you know, uh, the pandemic which is going on. Uh, but we are really missing the live audience. Uh, we got some feedback, there's some technical glitch. We really apologize for that. Uh, next performance would be of Dr. Ram. Uh, Ram Prapanna Bhattacharya and again uh, vocalist it will end with our uh, performance with uh, of Dr. Satrupa uh, Kar who uh, would again uh, you know perform and end this program. Lot many things to do under this uh, committee of uh, tourism and culture. We have many plans and I'm sure we are going to do such more beautiful programs uh, in future as well when things normalize. With this I hand over the rest of the evening to our committee co-chair, Mr. Manish Daya. Manish, if you can please come and take over. Thank you so much, everyone. Thank you, Anindita. Well, our next artist and performance on sitar is Ram Prapanna Bhattacharya Ji. Ram Prapanna Bhattacharya has already established himself as one of the most striking, distinguished and serious young musicians in the music fraternity. His vibrant performances exemplify his technical prowess, aesthetic brilliance, deep understanding of nuisance of raga music and rhythmic intricacies, which gave an enchanting experience to his audience every time. He was initiated to sitar by his father, Sri Ram Udar Bhattacharya, and received intense guidance from him. Subsequently, he was privileged to have talim from late Pandit Kashinath Mukherjee, 
till Panditji's demise. He has received music lessons and guidance from Pandit Arvind Parikh as well. He has innumerable stage performances for the prestigious music events, both at home and abroad, which have been highly acclaimed by connoisseurs, critics, and musicians alike. Recently, his performance for Indian Embassy Philippines to celebrate India's 70th Republic Day was highly appreciated by all dignitaries and foreign delegates, including Honorable Admin Ambassador for India. He was awarded at the Banquet Hall of the Glasgow Hilton Hotel for his sensational sitar performance. His performances were released later by HCL under several series that includes Maestros in Studio, Sound of Sargam, and Baitak series. He has numerous awards and accolades, including Pandit A. Kanan Memorial Award, scholarship from Ministry of Culture, Government of India, first prize for intercollegiate music competition, youth festival, just to name a few. Being deeply rooted in the classical tradition, Ram Prapanna has been teaching music for several years with respectable results. He conducted seminars, workshops, presentations in multiple venues, both in India and abroad. Ram Prapanna has worked as IT consultant for organizations, including Oracle, Tata Consultancy Services, Cognizant, Cape Gemini for several years. Presenting to you, Sri Ram Prapanna Bhattacharya Ji. Over to you, sir. Namaskar, good evening. I welcome you all to this part of the overall program where I will present Sita recital on Rag Desh to start with. My heartfelt thanks and gratitude to CII for inviting me for this event where all other wonderful performers are presenting their art form. I'm really feeling privileged today. Thank you very much.
Thank you, Shri Ram Prapanna Bhattacharya Ji. It was indeed a very soulful experience and I'm sure everyone enjoyed as much as I did over here. It was really a treat to the years. Thank you so very much. And uh, just as a token of thanks uh, on behalf of CI for gracing this evening and making this occasion a uh, memorable one. Thank you very, very much. Well, ladies and gentlemen, as part of the final act for the evening, I would like to once again invite Dr. Satrupa Roy Kerr, a versatile singer from Hyderabad, again to introduce her. 
She did her PhD in biotechnology. She always tries to continue her musical career as well. She learned Hindustani classical from Sri Upendranath Ghosh and Srimati Prema De. I would like to once again call her on stage and give her the final performance for the evening. I hope you enjoy this. We are really sorry there was a technical glitch and uh, hence we would like to once again request uh, Dr. Satrupaji to come over and take the stage. Thank you. I need this feedback monitor again. Feedback monitor. Good evening, everybody. So I am here again, as they have explained, and they requested me to perform once again. Uh, this is a very common problem in this virtual platform. So sometimes this happens. So we don't have to uh, do anything. So from uh, from the, my previous performance, some people reported that it uh, was not uh, properly hard. So I am uh, trying to perform something. I think I will repeat. And now I will be performing one Sharaswati Vandana, then uh, Vande Mataram again. And at, at the end, I will perform the same fusion, uh, Vairavi fusion, so that uh, maybe, hopefully, we can get better sound quality this time. Let's hope for the best. <clears throat> uh, increase reverb a little bit. And uh, please send your feedback whether this is properly uh, audible or not, so that I can uh, adjust a little bit performance. <laughs> Ya Kundindu Tushar Har Bhavala 
शुभर वस्त्रता ब्रह्मच्युत शंकरा प्रभृति वे देव सदा वंदिता साम पात सरस्वती सरस्वती भगवती शेष जा
Now the last four performance is again the Vairobi Fusion. Usually we finish any concert with Vairobi, but I started with that. And again, I got this opportunity to finish with Vairobi. So that is the advantage I can take. Uh, the track is not coming. Let's see, let's see. 
हल्के मिले सुर मेरा तुम्हारा मिले सुर मेरा तुम्हारा तो सुर बने हमारा मिले सुर मेरा तुम्हारा मिले सुर मेरा तुम्हारा तो सुर बने हमारा तो सुर बने हमारा तो सुर बने हमारा जय हिंद थैंक यू thank you dr satrupa ji for that finale grand performance it was indeed worth waiting to hear you again thank you very very much indeed and well ladies and gentlemen on behalf of cii celebrating 125 years i would like to once again thank all our distinguished guests this evening cii members all our wonderful artists and to you our virtual audience in making this virtual musical concert a memorable one as part of this initiative we will try and do many such evenings and concerts to bring to you some of the best artists and to showcase what we have as talent and culture and most importantly to showcase what we have uh, well to thank who have made this evening possible i would now once again thank all our sponsors that include our associate sponsors netco pharma shanta vasan trust our co associate sponsor bharat biotech international limited and our hospitality partner notel hyderabad convention center with that thank you very much again for joining us this evening all of you have a wonderful evening and uh, thank you again and look forward to many more uh, such events to work along thank you very much indeed jai hind namaste well uh, i would also like to call upon uh, our artist on stage to do one uh, group picture dr satrupa ji and shri ram prapanna <laughs> 